Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Monica and in today's video I am going to be cleaning up my kitchen. I'm going to be taking some of the decor down and adding a little bit of a fresh new look in here. So I hope that you all enjoy today's video. I hope it gives you some cleaning motivation as well as some decorating inspiration. So let's get right into it. I can take it anymore. Okay, so before I head on into the kitchen and start doing some cleaning up in there, I wanted to share these adorable glass bottles that I purchased off of Etsy just recently. I got one for my fabric softener and one for my laundry detergent, and they are so gorgeous. I have tried using the really pretty containers that are usually meant for like drinks that you buy like in the store, and they never work. They always get like clogged up, and I ended up I end up just throwing them out and not going with those anymore but these are amazing I absolutely love these they have these pumps on them that work absolutely great actually too great so you got to be careful <laughs> when you are pumping the liquid out because it does come out pretty quickly but um, I think these look so pretty in here I love Putting some of my normal everyday products in prettier containers I just think it looks prettier when you have them sitting out on your countertops and all that so I'm just gonna add like a lazy Susan on top of my washer and then add my softener and my laundry detergent um, containers up here along with some scent beads that I have in a glass jar Okay, so I had this bright idea to use these measuring cups for the containers when I dispensed the softener and the detergent, but they didn't work out too well and I'm not going to fuss with it too much. So I ended up just using the original containers, like the caps that those two items came with and it works out better and I just kind of hid those away behind the Lazy Susan. Okay, so now that I have a load of laundry going, I am going to head on into the kitchen and I am going to put a load of dishes away. There are clean dishes in the dishwasher, so I'm going to get those put away very quickly and then I'm going to start cleaning up around here. I have some stuff to put away on the countertops and then I'm going to completely clear off the countertops and get them wiped down and nice and clean and I will be taking down a lot of my farmhouse type decor I had talked about this over on my Instagram and I am just really over the farmhouse look I love certain items that are somewhat farmhouse but like I want to get rid of like the signs like the black and white signs and um, that kind of stuff I am just really over the farmhouse look so I want to get rid of that look altogether and um, so that's what I am going to be doing today I just really want to declutter in here and make everything look really fresh and really clean and my kitchen is extremely small my entire house is very small so I feel like the less I have in each room the better it looks to the eye just because it is a small space so I really want to achieve that type of a look. I want to use a lot of neutral colors and less items. So that's what I will be doing today. I 
did have some of my Easter decor still up, so I'm gonna go ahead and take all of that down and put that away as well. And I did have some in my formal dining room. I had my table setting still laid out. So I'm gonna go in there really quickly and then take all that down and put that away as well. What it's like to be seen through magazines, never Now that I have my countertops all cleared off, I'm going to clean them and today I will be using the Caldrea all-purpose cleaner and this scent is called Rose Water Driftwood and I am obsessed with it. My dish soap is the same scent. I just love it. I also keep a linen spray up in my bedroom and I just love, love, love this scent. It smells so incredibly good. If I can find a link for it, I will leave it down in my description box. Also, if there is any link that you are looking for, like if you see an item in my house and you want to know where I purchased it and you can't find the link in my description box, please ask in the comments and I will be more than happy to provide that link for you. But always check my description box first because I do try to leave a lot of links in there for you. I get a lot of questions about certain specific items more than others, so I do like to keep those links in there all the time. Hey, you say it is just you and I, and everything is so, thing is so. So call me out, call me out, baby. I'm bringing my bread box back out if you've been with me for a while I did purchase this quite some time ago and I had it stashed away because I had a farmhouse type bread box out on my countertops well I am getting rid of that one and I'm bringing this one back out I love it I feel like it has more of a vintage French country feel to it and I just love that copper look. And I did find this at Home Goods and it was $19.99. I wanted to add a really natural look to the top of my refrigerator and I didn't want to add florals so I thought some stacked baskets and a vintage style mirror would look really pretty up here so that's what I did and I love how it turned out. Okay so I'm going to bring out some of my really pretty china and I have collected some of these pieces throughout the years and I did have them put away in my cabinet upstairs and then I also had some stashed away in my china cabinet down here but I love these pieces and I think they're just so beautiful and I wanted to give that French country type feel in the kitchen and I thought displaying these beautiful teacups on my shelf would definitely do the trick so that's what I'm doing so call me up,
shining armor and i'm sure as hell i'm not a savior when you need me to be i'm not the flare of light you see when it gets dark i'm not a knight in shining armor and i'm sure as hell i'm not a savior I really wanted to free up some space here in the kitchen because it does get kind of cramped looking the more pieces I add in here. So I decided to take this wicker type shelf or corner shelf and move it into the other room. And then I'm going to take my beautiful plant that I had in that uh, wicker shelf and I'm just going to place it here in my island and it looks absolutely perfect and I feel like it will do well over here. These patho plants are very hard to kill and I have not even seen this one wilt on me like ever. And I do know that it has gotten dry quite a few times, but this plant is definitely loving me right now. So I hope it's not too upset with the move. While I was at the regular grocery store, I also found these beautiful peach or coral colored roses and some beautiful coral colored or peach colored stock with some eucalyptus leaves. And I thought they would look so pretty here in the kitchen. And I'm just gonna quickly cut them up and put them in the vase. And you will see here in a second that I switched it out and recut them down because when I had made this arrangement, I didn't like how far the stems were sticking up. So I ended up taking it all apart and redoing it over again. But these flowers are just so incredibly beautiful. I can climb no mountains or swim in cold water. Now that I have my mess cleaned up from my arrangement, I am going to be uh, rinsing off these dishes and loading them up into the dishwasher. These were dishes that I had just had displayed out on that wicker type shelf that you had seen me move a few minutes ago. And I'm just gonna place these in the dishwasher and get those nice and cleaned. And then I'm going to be cleaning out my sink and I will be using the soft scrub cleanser for that. This one has the bleach in it, so it disinfects as well. And I absolutely love using soft scrub bleach for my sink. You can also use Barkeeper's Friend. And I do believe that Mrs. Myers has a soft scrub type cleanser as well that works really good. And it has a really fresh scent to it. I can't remember what scent that is, but I have used it in the past but definitely soft scrub is my absolute favorite product to use on my sink. See you in 
So once I get this table all cleared off and the items put away, I am just going to give it a really quick clean and I will be using the same product that I used on my countertops, which is the Caldrea countertop spray and it is in the rose water driftwood scent. And once I have that all finished, I'm going to be vacuuming my floors and I do use the Shark Lift Away Duo. And I do have that linked in my description box if you are interested. I love this vacuum. It works extremely well, in my opinion, better than the Dyson. Never underestimate the power of just a few very small changes to a room, just taking things away and decluttering can make a huge difference and I really feel that there is a difference in here even though I didn't do anything very drastic. I love the look that I am having in here. I think it looks beautiful and I love that stuff is put away and there isn't as much on my countertops it already makes my kitchen feel a little bit bigger i love the french look that i have with the teacups on my shelf and i just think it looks really pretty in here and i just absolutely love how everything looks so that is it for today's video i hope that you guys all enjoyed it i hope it gave you some cleaning motivation i hope it gave you some decorating ideas as well and if you did enjoy today's video please be sure to give me a thumbs up be sure to say hi down in the comments below. It really, really does help my channel and I appreciate it so incredibly much. If you are new here, please be sure to click that red subscribe button so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. I hope that you guys all have a fabulous day and I will see you in the next one. Bye!